hello again and welcome back to the channel richard here again with another unboxing video and today it's the new 4k ultra hd blu-ray limited edition set of the texas chainsaw massacre and this is from second sight here in the uk so second sight as you probably aware um got quite a lot of videos on my channel got a playlist um they churn out uh, top quality releases uh, excellent packaging and special features as well uh, this is their latest one obviously of course this is uh, 4k uh, ultra hd so um, they're the team responsible for the drive set um, and the babadook was another one um, yeah top quality stuff um, so as you can see it's a high quality rigid outer slip case um, it's a nice matte finish uh, no emboss work no deboss work and no spot gloss work on it uh, the the 18 bbfc certificate is on the j slip so that is removable um, which i'm going to do so we'll have a quick look at the back so you can see what we're getting into so it's a three disc set featuring one UHD and two Blu-rays with bonus features on both formats. The UHD is presented in Dolby Vision and the Dolby Atmos and produced by Second Sight. Um, I was wondering if it would have um, Dolby Atmos on because of the old um, turbine set that I've got here, um, which is very early 4K, um, which was 220 minutes worth of bonus features, which is what I'm looking at here i will bring that in in a minute it's um it's that release um which has got the Auro 3d on there as well as dolby atmos um good soundtrack uh so back to the features on here so i've got new audio commentary we've got another audio commentary another one it's quite a lot of commentaries the legacy of the chain the texas chainsaw massacre is a new feature length documentary produced by second sight and there's a lot of other features as well if you want to pause it there by all means do so and this is what you get in this limited edition so rigid slipcase with original classic artwork 190 page hardback book with new hardback book with new essays um illustrations by adam stothard and six collector art cards the blu-ray discs will be region b locked as indicated by the logo at the bottom but of course the 4k disc is region free as always um, if it isn't region free then it doesn't conform to the uhd alliance so it shouldn't even be on a disc because uh, that's what they all agreed is that 4k discs will be region free no matter where they are in the world so the ones that have sneaked through shouldn't have happened so there's a good look at the slipcase uh, good quality card involved again uh, nice little bit of artwork so we've got the cards we've got the book it's a big book this one hardbound yeah top quality on this one gonna have a good read of that after and a digi pack for the disc housing uh, got some nice wraparound artwork here oh disc's gone flying it's come loose in transit that's really nice artwork uh, it's disc three that's gone walkies which is the UHD. So while I've got it out, it's a triple layer, 100 gig disc. That's great to hear. Um, the second Blu-ray disc is a single layer, 25 gig. And the first Blu-ray disc with the movie on is a dual layer, 50 gig. So 
that's quite nice. Let's move on to the book. I won't be showing much of it because I don't want to give it away if anybody hasn't seen the movie. Um, if you want to check the movie out for the first time, get the 4K. Um, it's going to look pretty good with Second Sight involved. So a lot of information here on the movie. So flicking through a lot of a lot of nice artwork, uh, keeping the style throughout. Um, white, red, and black. Um, it's quite a nice set. This. Anything at the back about the restoration? So the production credits. Let's zoom in on that. I always like to give a shout out to the guys responsible for putting these releases together. So great to see straight away. Um, restoration work's been done at Silver Salt Restoration. They do a good job. And the Blu-ray mastering and quality controls by Fidelity in Motion, who, if you're familiar with watching my videos, I always give a shout out to Fidelity in Motion. They um, do a lot of great stuff, a lot of great transfers. Um, Good to see Philip Escott involved with the legacy of the Chainsaw che uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Uh, writer and director and editor and producer. Um, great to see him involved. I'm hoping Philip can actually put together a nice release like this for Dead Man Shoes. Um, such a good film and I think it would sell well for um, Second Sight. And I know they'd give it the proper treatment that that film deserves. Um, Optimum releasing who are now Studio Canal. I haven't done nothing with that release um, since the Bare Bones Blu-ray years and years and years ago. Um, so I'm hoping they can pick it up. Um, they've really done a good job on this one. Uh, let's have a look at these six art cards. So again, this nice artwork, the same theme carried through, red and black and white. Really nice. Uh, they're not thin, um, thin art cards. It's a matte finish. So really nice huge fan of this movie like I said this was the release I've had for years um, from Germany from Turbine Media uh, this had the Dolby Atmos and Auro 3D 13.1 soundtrack um, that was housed on a I actually can't tell I can't count the hubs on this one so whether it's a single layer UHD, I, I really can't tell on that one. Um, so there's like the film in there and then special features on there. So I won't be parting with this. I will be keeping it for the special features that are on here and then see the special features that are on this new set. Um, and then I've got this... Um, Beast as well from Germany. Uh, this was their exclusive Texas Chainsaw Massacre limited edition box set, which was limited to a thousand, and I was lucky to get one at 539, um, which obviously had t shirts inside. Um, I survived the Texas Chainsaw Massacre sticker. We got some nice um, postcards of the event. So if you wanted to send them to your friends that you're having a nice time, there you go. So put the address on, nice little photo. Um, then there was a car bumper sticker. 
a steelbook, which is actually a future pack, but nice all the all the same. And then there was a a Necker. Yeah, really nice set. And a massive poster. And back two. So yeah, lucky to have it. Um, one part with it. Um, same with the 4K that they did, and the same with this second site. I'll be adding them to the collection and treasuring them. So um, yeah, if you're a fan of the movie, please uh, comment uh, down below. Um, be good to hear from you. And if you are picking up this release or the the bare bones um, 4K release or the Blu-ray for this new second sight transfer. Um, but yeah, if you did enjoy this video and look at the other stuff, um, please give the video a like and consider subscribing for more. But um, for now, that's the end of this one. Get them all back in and then put it back in so easily fit in. Yeah, that is one big book. Definitely gonna have a good, uh, good read of that after I've watched the film and seen all the special features. But uh, that's it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you again soon. Goodbye.